Hey there crew members, Starfleet personnel. In the last video I showed you the hangar bay doors, the very rough model, cardboard model of the hangar bay doors. Since that video, was it five days ago now, got a great response by the way and some awesome comments so thank you very much again. Thank you for coming on board and thank you for all your support. But I'm sat here in real life and, and when I'm working on this I'm actually <laughs> I'm actually beginning to feel as though I'm on the USS Enterprise, okay? It's, it's just incredible, it really is. As always, I'm going to give you the hand, handheld tour uh, and show you, some, show you some perspectives, some views uh, that, that you have never seen before. I think it was the, the episode The Conscience of the King uh, and we do see that observation gallery um, briefly, but I'm going to show you something that we didn't see. I'm going to actually take the camera and look through the windows of the observation gallery down into the hangar deck. And I'm really enjoying this kind. I'm really enjoying this kind of stuff because you know we're, we're, we are just getting to see areas of the ship from perspectives we never saw before. Also, there was a comment from uh, one of the followers, one of the subscribers who said in the last video where I showed the, uh, the, the bay doors, the clamshell doors, he said it would have been really nice because the model in the last video, it, look, it, looks, it looked huge, and it is huge, but he said it would have been really nice if we could have seen that the, the clamshell doors in relation to the rest of the secondary hull like what we have here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to place this model against this uh, slice of the secondary hull. Let's do that handheld tour right now. Here we are at the back of the hangar deck. The, uh, the bay doors are open. Just going to move in and there on the hangar deck is a cutaway of a 125th scale shuttle craft and I'm just going to lift up from the shuttle craft so you can see the rest of the hangar bay and there's the observation gallery so we're just going to come across here and up to the observation gallery here and I'm just going to place our crew member right there so this is what it would be like to walk along that observation gallery <laughs> it's just fantastic isn't it look down into the hangar deck and we're moving around past the uh, superstructure, the curving superstructure of the secondary hull. Along here, I'm going to move in close. So there they are. There's there's the hangar bay doors. Looking through the observation gallery, walking along the observation gallery. We're ready to check the shuttlecraft as it takes off through those doors, through those bay doors. Moving across, we can see the rest of the observation gallery around here. And there's the slice of the secondary hull on the wall in the background. Continuing around, quickly around. And there we go. Okay, so we're down on the uh, flight deck level again. Just come down from the observation gallery. We're down on the flight deck level. Moving in to these uh, very large doors leading into the midsection of deck 19, which is shuttle storage. 
and there's there's a shuttle there's again the cut cut out of the shuttle coming out of those doors moving across to the uh, the regular sized door here which is where people would exit the uh, the flight deck into the interior of the secondary hull and I'll just give you a, a long shot of the whole of the model I'm going to do uh, I'm going to do quite a lot more work on this actually because I want to also I also want to build um, more of this kind of hull structure like here and here and here and coming across down to the bay doors here so so then you with with those um, with those mega structures in place you'll get a really clear feeling of the uh, of the hangar deck there okay so now I'm gonna I'm gonna show you how this hangar deck relates to that uh, that cutaway of the secondary hull that I have on the wall okay so we're just coming down to where we started there is the whole model laid out on the table many many people asking the question how big is this final model going to be and uh, I've said in previous videos but I'll say it again now the finished model will be 40 feet long and 11 feet high and the whole thing will be supported on a metal frame the finished model will be made of wood and high quality uh, modeling board let's take a look at this hangar deck in relation to the secondary hull so I've separated the clamshell doors from the rest of the flight deck from the rest of, rest of the hangar deck just so you can get a very clear uh, view of the, of the relationship between the size of the flight deck and the rest of the secondary hull okay and again just to, just to illustrate how massive this model is of course these clamshell doors when they are attached to the rest of the hangar deck uh, would uh, comes to about here, right? And that this is why I separated the clamshell doors because when this comes towards the camera, uh, you can't really get an idea of the size ratio of, of of the hangar deck to the rest of the secondary hull. But attached to the rest of the flight deck, it comes out to about here, and even that isn't the end because beyond. The, uh, the 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 wall the back wall of the flight deck of the hangar deck where the observation gallery is there's still quite a lot of space before you get to this point because this here is the widest part of the secondary hull and then of course beyond this uh, there is still uh, quite a distance to go before you get to the uh, the forward sensor absolutely enormous enormous 125th scale model uh, and there of course you can see our crew members stood on deck 16 and captain kirk himself on deck 15 the secondary hull strongback if you're enjoying the content of these videos please do consider subscribing to the channel and hit the notification bell i hope this video finds you well and i'll see you soon in four or five days with the finished version of this. Have a great day. Bye for now.